Hey guys, George here. And today we're gonna show you how I install the Woodland Scenics Just Plug Lighting as you're seeing here in this video. Now these are stock off the shelf Just Plug Lighting fixtures. And these plug right into the ground and then plug right into the hub, which then powers the LEDs inside the lighting fixtures. So let's take a look at how I install them so that not only is it easy to install into a foam base, but also so they can be removable for a future project. So let's get started. Now the tools we're gonna to use for this installation are a 5 30 seconds drill bit on the end of a drill. We're gonna use some 5 30 seconds inch tubing from Evergreen Styrene. We're gonna use standard street lights uh, from Woodland Scenics Just Plug. We need an X-Acto knife and some wood glue to glue the tubes into place. Okay, so here's how we're gonna do this. First off, you wanna find the place that you're going to install the light. In this case, I'm gonna install it right about here. So I'm gonna take a, just a traditional Sharpie marker and I'm going to, yeah, we'll put it right there. We'll mark a little dot that we're gonna use for our drill. Now to do this, we're gonna take a drill and in this case, I'm using an eighth inch diameter drill. And we're gonna go ahead and drill a hole through the foam and through the scenery right where that mark is. And of course the foam material gives a little bit. And so now we have our hole right there. Next, we're gonna take a piece of our styrene rod that I talked about earlier, and we're gonna go ahead and push that through the hole, make sure that the hole works, and then make sure it clears all the way through to the bottom. So now that we've got our styrene rod in here, what we need to do is we need to mark it so that the styrene rod on the bottom of the foam will be flush with the top of the layout here. So we're gonna grab our marker again, we're gonna put a small little mark. Right now that's flush at the bottom, so I'm gonna raise it up just a little bit. Put a little hash on the side of the, on the side of the styrene rod. We're gonna pull that out, and then we're gonna cut it. So now once we have our pieces of styrene cut, we're just gonna gently take the knife, and we're just gonna open up the inside of that hole just a little bit, just to make sure that our lighting fixture will fit into there perfectly. Now we're gonna take a little dab of wood glue. We're gonna roll the tube into it. You don't need to coat the whole thing because as you press it through that tiny hole, it will coat the, the tubing. So now we're gonna press this into the hole that we've created. I'm gonna run that flush and wipe away any excess. And then we'll take a And then next we'll take our knife and just make sure that the inside of that tubing is clear of any glue. All right, now that that's in, you can see how it's flush to the ground. Now you can just let it dry for a couple of hours and move on to your other project. So now that we've let this thoroughly dry, we're gonna take our just plug lighting and we're gonna take the wires out of the coil here. And once that's done, now we're gonna take these wires and we're gonna feed them through the tube we just glued into place. Now because the tube goes all the way through the foam, the wires now just simply feed through. And then when we get here to the end, our light fits in place, just like that. Now you can do the other lights throughout your entire section, and then we'll get to the wiring section next. Now once we're on the underside of the foam, and now we have wire management. So the first thing we wanna do is to take 
the wire that's coming through and put a little loop into it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to tape this wire to the underside of the foam. Now the reason we do that is so that if later on we need to remove that pole or move it away so we can do some cleaning or something like that, we have a little bit of play in the wire so we can pull that lamp up out of the tube and lay it down so that we don't break it off. So we're just going to take some traditional clear packing tape. We're going to put this little loop here and then we're going to take the wire and we're going to secure it in place just like that. Now you can do this for each of the lamps that you've installed in your particular area so that that way the wires can now all come together so that you can wire them together and drop them down to your just plug hub. Now once we get our light wires threaded through to the underside of the layout, now we take them, connect them to this just plug connector, and then we move them over and plug into the just plug lighting module. So that's pretty much all there is to it. Let's take a look at the finished product. So now that you've seen how I do my installation of these just plug lighting, hopefully you can use this technique on your layouts at home. Thanks for watching guys.